everyone so much for joining me here guys this is going to be your daily reading leos for your general and love energies for the day leos so what is coming up for your general energies and love energies for the day today i will be also picking out some messages this person has for you guys just after this reading i will be picking out the message cards uh, with these cards of what messages this person has and what did this person want to tell you right now so just stay tuned for that guys i will just be starting off with the general energies and love energies for the day and moving on with the messages this person has for you guys and if you like this reading like comment and subscribe to support me guys and also if you want to book a personal reading with me you can book a personal reading all of the details are there in the description box of the reading okay so let us begin with the general energy check for the day guys just one more shuffle general energies my sun moon rising and venus layer signs okay so for your general energies for the day your person's love towards you and the mutual love you both share for each other so for your general energy for the day we have the the dawn the golden had duty so for your general energies for the day leos it is all about understanding the deeper meanings of yourselves you're going to think a lot about yourself you're going to do what's right for you and leaving out on the stuff that you feel like you need to leave out on is what i feel with these cards right you're doing what you're supposed to you're leaving out on the stuff that you're not supposed to go into and also leos today is the day one you will have that sense of duty so you're kind of concerned about yourselves your love situation your um, general situation whatever it is guys you're very much concerned about yourself you're concerned about being this responsible person and today is going to be the um, things are going to go just according to your expectation but do not uh, put your money in any kind of investments because it can go into loss is what i feel guys it's time for you to spend your money with a lot of uh, thinking and with a lot of um, knowledge about it because it can be easy for you today to lose money so do not worry about that it's just a um, message that i need to i feel like i need to give you all and um, if you're uh, feeling like especially getting indulging in any kind of like a luxurious uh, treats or something like that you want to spend money in some kind of a lavish way in kind of a luxurious way is also what i feel but it's good if you try to avoid that guys because um things are not really going to turn out according to your expectations if you are uh, going to kind of waste the money okay what is coming up for the love situation how does this person think and feel we have the wounds so this is all about this person is uh, very depressed they're sad they feel wounded without you okay no one is um, being nice or kind to this person guys okay no one is kind to this person no one is nice to this person except you so they're kind of realizing their value they are wounded and they're realizing your value leos is what i feel this person might also be crying because they are very depressed they're wounded by their own things they're wounded by their own words so that is what i feel here guys leos what is the mutual energy between you guys we have the dedication i feel like this person has was once dedicated in this connection and uh, you are very dedicated to this person that is the mutual energy between you guys there is a lot of dedication between you both there is a lot of love and there is a lot of patience and you love this person they love you both love each other and there is a lot of dedication in this connection but they are also willing to come towards you with the same dedication they once showed earlier if they showed you all the dedication and love earlier this person is going to come back again that way 
Okay, so now let me pick out some cards of this person's messages towards you guys. Hi guys, so this is going to be the message from your person reading, uh, how this person thinks, feels and the messages towards you guys. So let us find out what is this person's messages towards you. It is not going to be in a pick a card reading format, it's just going to be a normal message from your person reading. Okay, so what messages does this person have for you today? Still guys and angels message for you this is how this person what this person wants to tell you and how this person feels about you guys okay i'll just uh, lay down these cards so that it will be easier for me to um talk about it messages this person has let me just shuffle and pick out the cards guys for you messages this person has for you guys okay not so hard to work with these cards okay so messages this person has what does this person need to tell you okay so let me just begin with the message this person has for you guys just uh, arrange these cards here and then begin with the reading okay so we have, I'm trying to take my responsibilities for my actions right now, please know this. So this person did something that they want to take responsibilities for. They really are uh, being sad that they didn't treat you right. I don't know if I can meet your expectations. They're very, they're feeling insecure if they can meet your expectations. They're feeling insecure about themselves. They don't know why everything is taking them into, okay with this card i'm just doing what i have to do right now so this person is not in a good situation guys the people around them are pressurizing them into do something and this person doesn't want to do that i've never gotten you even though you think i have so this person feels like they have never um, had you with them they never like uh, spend good time with you okay so they want to spend more time with you to understand you get to know you i mean this person and you have spent time together but they want to talk to you and find out what you're all about okay so this person is uh, wanting something a relationship that is based on mutual trust and they want to build a trust by talking to you expressing to you about the feelings about the way they are how they are so that you will understand them um, so only when there is understanding the trust can build between you both and they want this to happen i can seem to find the right words to say to you so this person is feeling really left out they do not know what to say to you right now they do not know what to do right now they're not really happy as well as they're feeling somewhat irritated with the overall situation right I'm sorry I held myself back with you. They're very sad that they held themselves back with you because maybe this person didn't uh, come forward to give you anything or they were always distant from you and they kind of did regret being distant from you because they want something that is like a union that is forever together with you guys okay the grass wasn't greener on the other side so this person has definitely went through like they left you and they went and or they kind of like uh, stopped communicating and they went to another person and mostly this person didn't treat them right they betrayed them this person was not kind loving and caring like how they thought this person would be and this person was cheated by the other person and that is why they are saying the grass wasn't greener on the other side it was that good it, they thought it would be good but then it turned out to be not so good and they kind of betrayed they betrayed themselves now i can take this anymore so they cannot take this separation anymore they want to have that conversation they want to talk to you they want to talk to you and come towards you again it's easier to stay away right now at the same time they feel like it's easier to stay away from you 
so they want to come towards you guys but something is stopping them from coming towards you maybe the answers that they need to give you when they come towards you or maybe certain things that they feel is very unacceptable they're coming back towards you for a reason if you think like this person doesn't love you or something so the last thing they want is get a bad name from you guys and um, for that is the only reason that they're not coming they're not going away from you guys okay so they do love you they do want you but at the same time they're having a lot of uh, thoughts inside of their head which is twisting them apart but yes end of the day the intuition will win and they'll come towards you guys so thank you so much for joining me here for this uh, reading and i will see you guys tomorrow with another reading bye guys